Is your Black Fruits meta in PvP? Update 24. Now, before you roast me in the comments, I'll tell you my criteria real quick. I will rank the fruits based on the following. First, if they have PvP potentials. If they have useful skills for PvP like a stun or fast attacks. Then, if they are user-friendly. There are some OP fruits out there but they are so hard to use you can't really count them as totally broken. Then of course, damage. This is already obvious. Now, let's get started. Rocket! I do not even need to say this. Your fruit is the god of all things that can one-shot everything. So obviously, Kilo Tear. Spin! This is the most trash fruits in Black Fruit's history that even a rework can save it. So, D Tear. Chop! Although it's one of the cheapest fruit, it has a troll privilege that no one has. That's right, immunity to sword users. That's why it's a troll tier, baby. Spring. Oh, this guy is definitely one of the strongest meta. In Monkey Island, no doubt about it. D tier. Bomb. This fruit has the highest damage in the game, but it's basically a one time nuke that is so useless in a real PvP match. D tier, you gotta go. Smoke. This is one of the meta pack on C1, but now it's just a lung cancer joke. Yeah, D tier. Spike. No unique skills that shines in PvP, just like any other chip group. Yeah, yet again, back to D tier. Flame. Now we're talking. This is one of the decent fruit in PvP and even in grinding, especially when it's awakened. Gotta put it in BT. Falcon. This guy is the second hand of the gods. He's the second to their power that can two shots everyone. So, kill a tier. Ice. High tier that have good PvP potentials, but unfortunately, weak on air battles. A tier. Sand. One of the strongest stuns in the game that even the pros can't escape. But with the price of it being slow, that is a bad effect in PvP. But still, A tier. Dark. Great PvP potentials. It's both competent on air battles and land battles. But sadly, overshadowed by other fruits like Doe. So, A tier. Diamond. Hell nah bro, why is this guy on rare categories of fruit? Just get back to me again when you became strong as Buddha or something. Kilo tier. Light. This is one of the most fun fruit to use in PvP because of its mobility. Plus, it has a great PvP potential. So, it's perfect. A tier. Rubber. It has great damage but low AoE that requires precise skill and timing to use. Nevertheless, it's still decent, so B tier, barrier. All I can say is that you're a great troll fruit. No more comment. Troll tier. Ghost. You're a decent fruit but you're also one of the unique one. So cheer up, C tier. Magma Easy to use, arguably the best Logia with Doe and Rumble with a bonus of great grinding potential. So, A tier. Quick It's a great fruit with PvP useful skills but seriously needs a rework. I'm sorry quick user, but I have to put this on B tier. Let's fight in the comments. Put it. I really hate to say this but this guy is high tier even though it's brain dead fruit. Forgive me god for what I'm about to do. A tier. Love. This is one of the skilled and user oriented fruit so it depends on the user if it's good or not. A tier. Spider. One of the decent fruit that is actually fun. 
you can feel Spider-Man vibes with it during PvP, so that's a plus point. Anyway, it's still BTR though, I don't care. Sound Decent again, although not as fun as Spider unfortunately, but it's a visual appealing fruit though, BTR. Phoenix One of the glorious fruit with the coolest drip, but yeah. Weak in PvP. C tier. Portal. Now, this fruit depends on the user. If he's bad at using it, it sucks. But if he use it right, he's a god. A tier. Rumble. Even without a rework after all these years, this still remains one of the best fruit skill based top tier fruit. If you see a third C player using this fruit, run. S tier. Pain. Good fruit with extreme range but requires massive skill to use. As per in criteria, that's a bad point. So, B tier. Blizzard. Although it's a no skill fruit, we gotta admit it's pretty OP in PvP. I'ma put it in A tier. Gravity. I think this fruit is the only mythical fruit that's not too OP. It's decent in PvP, but it's not that broken. Let's put you on A tier. Mammoth. Seriously. These fruits need to be stopped. It's getting annoying with their brain dead abilities. But that's what makes it meta. So, S tier, goddammit. T Rex. These and Mammoth should go back to the dinosaur age for real. This fruit is too broken that needs to be balanced quick. S tier. Zo. This fruit is a free bounty fruit. This fruit is a free bounty even I freaking hate to admit it. God damn it Black Fruits, when are you gonna nerf this mythical? S tier. Shadow. Finally, a mythical that is balanced. Maybe that's why little amount of people are using it now. A tier. Venom This is a former god tier fruit but now it's just a decent fruit on mythical category. It's a spam fruit but it's balanced compared to others. That's why A tier. Control God freaking tier. Of all the troll fruits of course baby. Troll tier. Spirit. All I can say is no matter what update, this guy stays in the meta for whatever reason. S tier. Dragon. This is the most hype meta right now because of the rework. This is gonna be equal for Dark Blade in trading in the first month of the update for some reason. S tier. Leopard Top 3 broken fruits in Black Fruits right now Please devs, nerf these brain dead fruits I beg you I Japanese beg you S tier though Kitsune A hack fruit with the balancing of super freaking rare You'll probably have more chance finding a million dollars on your bed than getting this fruit. S freaking tier. Thanks for watching. Now, do you agree with the rock? Do you freaking agree with the rock? <laughs>